I am. How does that work with the band? Well, it's kind of tricky. Uh, again, one of the reasons that uh, I didn't stay on with Iced Earth is because Iced Earth needed to go on and, and do more touring uh, to, to survive. Uh, it's, it's the way that the music industry has changed and, you know, pirating and downloading all this other stuff. Bands can't make a living off of records like they used to. That's just the, the plain truth of it. So, because if you're a band and you got to go out there and tour to make money, then I can't be your guy. Um, so that's why I'm in a uh, band with Van and Freddie because we're sort of of, of like minds where that's concerned. Um, this is kind of done around what I can do in my schedule uh, with my career, but uh, I will do everything and I've explained that to, to fans before and Nuclear Blast and, and to my bandmates that I will make every attempt in the world to, uh, to, to tour and support the, the record as much as I can, um, keeping in mind my career and my family life. So that's it. I will do the best I can and we're going to be playing Prog Power this year and Rock Harvest in the U.S. and we're going to be doing a bunch of shows with uh, Power Wolf in Europe. So there you go. Okay, so I'm assuming that this next question was posed to me specifically. Um, I think it might be profiling, but we'll, we'll continue on with it. So I tend to go on a little bit of the lighter side. Uh, there have been some great ones that have come out uh, recently that are, you know, very much dramatic. You know, Training Day and, and uh, you know, all those kind of movies, they're great. They are. I can't deny them. But I, I just like the comedy, a little bit lighter buddy movies. Um, well, one's not exactly a comedy, but... Um, I have to start off with uh, Lethal Weapon, and you can just put the guide and throw the, the series in there, or at least one and two. Uh, those are always great for uh, just to sit down and chill out and veg. Um, the next one I'd have to say uh, is kind of an obscure one a little bit from the from the 80s, and it would be Running Scared with Gregory Hines and Billy Crystal. Oh no! You know, that guy. You just missed the Bible question because you did not know what Deuteronomy was. But anyway, I digress. I would say that my, my third uh, installment for the, the action comedy kind of stuff would be uh, Bad Boys with Will Smith and Martin Lawrence. One and two, they were both, both really very entertaining movies. So, yes, a movie that Michael Bay made that didn't suck. Just kidding, Michael. I want to be in your movie. Just sign me up, man. All right? Anyway, later. Later.